Is he gonna come alive? Oh, he is alive! Am I cast out? But it is you who are the villains. How are we the villains? Father told me that I am hope. I am righteousness. That I am a god. His father told him. That is why I was born. As man and sin to both. Well, he was born as both? I thought he, like, I, I don't know, ate stuff to become it. Are you respecting me? Worship me? How can this be? I should be the one looking down at you. It's like you almost feel sorry for him. But not because we're convinced, more like I feel bad that he's so stupid, you know? <gasps> I forgot about this! Oh no! This is probably gonna do something bad to us! This is this is the problem. This is where it's gonna go wrong, isn't it? Because this is the final one. The final ether that we're gonna take in. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. It's happening. Hi, Maya. Okay. Is it gonna turn us into anything? Are we okay? We see we're okay. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. It's okay. Look, the sky. Turning into night. Nice. This is good. Right? Oh. Were it not for my decisive action, the whole Former city would have mayor. been overrun, razed to the ground. Yet they dare to complain about casualties? Spare me. I'll wager they were put up to it by those wretches who seek to usurp me. They're stirring up the citizenry. But if they think I will yield to the likes of them, they are gravely mistaken. To be subjected to such deplorable treatment, such ingratitude. You have my sympathy, sir. You do so much good for this city, and you could do so much more. We like this voice. Were you not surrounded by fools. Who are you? You're not supposed to be in here. Oh, you. <laughs> My apologies for the intrusion, but I come bearing a proposal. One that will ensure the longevity of your reign. Did, did he create Vothri? But give me the word, sir, and I will bring hither a light warden. By giving its power to the babe within your lady wife's womb, oh my God. we shall create a transcendent being. Why did he create him? To rule over all. And as sire to the king, your authority will never again be in question. Oh, 
I was starting to like Emmett, and now I'm a bit, like, questionable. <laughs> Amazing. Before my Vorthri, they behave as docile pets. I was starting to like you, Emmett. With Why? Gift, Why did you create this? With this gift, my guaranteed power for perpetuity. We shall rule the whole world. By all means, sir. United under Yulmor's banner, men will cease fighting and abandon their ambitions. Thus, they will grow fat and complacent, and in their sloth, seal your supremacy. <sighs> well then... No! No! We're fine! Stop it! Twelve for Fend. She cannot contain the light. She's beginning to turn. Are we gonna... Are we gonna... If you've ought up your sleeve, now is the time. It's changing back. No! No! Because we are now the Light Warden, so we need to be defeated now. The combined power of every Light Warden is too terrible a burden for any one soul to bear. Is he gonna help us? And so I shall relieve you of it. Wait, what? Is he gonna take it for himself? Exarch, what are you doing? What? You Ranger understand something that we don't? I will channel this profusion of power to the Crystal Tower and use it to travel to other worlds. As I have dreamed of doing ever since I first learned of their existence. Who would choose to remain here, in this dying realm, when they might go elsewhere and begin anew? What? And thus, thus did I use you. Well, he did all of this just so he could go I to a new world? You. It doesn't make sense! Damn you! We won't let you do with her as you please. Do not interfere! Please. I beseech you all, let him go. You knew of this, Urianger. He knew. It is all a fiction. Such vaguely defined acts of teleportation stand no chance of success. The Exarch will never live to see another world, as he knows only too well. Then, what does he mean to do? He means to take the light with him into the rift, where he will die. Wait, what? Wait, so he's a good guy now? He's sacrificing From himself? He intended to sacrifice himself to save our friend and no friend. But why would he pretend like he's evil? If he, if that's what he wants to do. So he's at journey's end, an opportunistic thief makes off with the hero's prize. A paltry way to end a chapter, I concede. Yet your tale will continue. And my role in it will scarcely be remembered. So he's actually good then. How did Ishtola figure that out? I guess because she saw that Yuri wasn't stopping him. And she had to think. Worry not. Whatever should become of me, I will be happy and free. Safe in the knowledge that I have played my part.
We can see his full face! What the... Call him by his name. We know him? Is it... The red eyes! Okay, my memory is really faded because it's been a while now, but Thank did we? For fighting for this world. For believing. He was the guy we met at Crystal Tower in ARR? Fare you well, my friend. My inspiration. My inspiration. Oh my god! Why did he hide his identity? Wait, what? What? <gasps> Emmett, no! I wanted to like you! Why are you Only destroying the everything? Possess the royal eye of the Alagan Imperial line are capable of controlling the Crystal Tower. I Such remember we yeah, we learned do that. Exist in the first. Huh? Therefore, in all likelihood, the Exarch arrived here with the tower. This much I had surmised, yet I could not discern his grand scheme. Think that he went through all this trouble for the sake of a single hero. It's almost admirable in its absurdity. Alas, it is not your grand scheme that will succeed, but ours. You bastard! Stay put. Your friend is still alive, but whether he remains so depends on you. Depends on us how. What a disappointment you turned out to be. What? I placed my faith in you. Let myself believe that you could contain oh. the light. But look at you now. Halfway to becoming a monster. You are a That's mean! No! No! Emmett, I started liking you. Please don't be disappointed in me. Yeah, we know that. We saw the flashback. I don't like <sighs> him anymore. I am an Asia. My heart's sole desire is to usher in the great rejoicing. Ouch! Yeah, I guess you are an Asian, but I thought you were ago, a good one. I entrusted my comrade Logriff with the task of increasing light sway over this world. This we sought to do by manipulating heroes. When that failed to achieve the desired result, I created Vorthry. Wait, what, what did he? No, I missed two lines now. Purpose in approaching us. By your twelve, boy, have I not told you before that everything I said was the truth? Okay, I, I wanted to read back because I, I missed one of the lines. I want to make sure I hear everything he says. A hundred years ago, I entrusted my comrade Logriff with the task of increasing light sway over this world. This we sought to do by, by manipulating heroes. Mmm. When that failed to achieve the desired result, I created Vothri. But thanks to your meddling, that too has ended in failure. What was your true purpose in approaching us? Alfredo asks. Okay. By your twelve, boy, have I not told you before that everything I said was the truth? Yeah, but probably with will withholding important information. were specimens by which I might gauge man's potential as it stands. I genuinely had an interest in you, genuinely considered taking you on as allies. 
No, we don't want to be acids. Provided she could contain and control the light. If not, then she, and by extension you, would be of no use to me. It was as simple as that. Mm. So, we've been found wanting. How disheartening. But even had we fulfilled your conditions, there was no guarantee that we would cooperate. What then? Then I simply kill you all. At the very least, it would restore the world to the way it was before you went about trouncing light wardens willy-nilly. Suffice it to say, it would be most inconvenient to have all that light taken away. And I would be lying if I were to claim his actions didn't have me worried. Senses. But you have all but become a sin eater. Whether you will it or no, your mere existence will serve to engulf the world in light. Those in your company will likewise turn into sin eaters, and in time you will succumb to your base instincts and hunt innocents to feast on their sweet, sweet no, ether. No. No, no, no. Those few with the will left to fight may rise up against you. But before your absolute might, they will quickly know despair. There is no hope. We are finished. Mankind is finished. Oh. The irony. What Vorth 3 achieved through bliss, you achieved through despair. But I have overstayed my welcome. I shall look forward to seeing you bring the world to its knees, hero. I don't like him anymore. He just stole him! I have naught to show for all the time and effort I invested in you. He is a small token for my troubles. I did not expect that I could learn aught from man, but I may yet learn something from all the knowledge he had hoarded for his precious hero. You can't just steal him from us. I pity you. I do. Oh, your friends no, he are now your us. foes. If you do not kill them, they will kill you. Oh God. When it all becomes too much to bear, seek me out at my abode in the dark depths of the tempest. Wait, there, why? You may complete your descent into madness with some dignity. Far from prying eyes. How nice of him. Offering a place for me to become a monster. Yeah, that's really nice. Till then, I bid you farewell. Eater. He calls us an eater! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, this is our room. Artbert. Ah, finally. How long have we been gone? Wait. What? No, no, I must have passed out. It was not a dream. You're confused. And small wonder.
After you collapsed, Emmett Silk vanished. Hmm. Then Reen did what she could to stay the raging of the light within your body. Did, wait, Reen Next calmed her, it down? You're still you. But she's only delayed the inevitable. That's why Emmett said you can come to us. Or come to me. Come to my house. How nice of him. Personal invite into his house. If this was before today, I would have been very excited, but now I don't trust him anymore. You're not going to like what you see, but you still need to see it. Okay. What does I need to see? Was everything we did undone? It's like this all over. The whole of Northland Oh my god. Oh my and god. You, and the power you absorb from the wardens. So I guess I need to be killed. No one knows but your friends. When they carried you down from the mountain, they told everyone waiting below that they didn't understand why the light had returned. And now they're out there trying to allay the people's fears, while searching for a way to save you. actual sin eater and we're gonna transform with time maybe we should give Emmett a call after you're well all enough to be up you're well enough to get some fresh air better that than stewing in here go on go And I guess I'm so much more powerful than all the other Light Wardens that me alone puts light in every zone, not just, like, one zone. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Warden of Light. Warden of Light. We're Light Warden. That was a huge plot twist. It's funny because I was so ready for a plot twist, which was the Exarch doing the whole sacrifice thing. No, okay, no, first it was Exarch being evil. And then it was plot twist, actually he's good. He wanted to sacrifice himself. And then he was somebody that we've seen in the past. And there was another plot twist and Emma just stops it. Just shoots him and apparently he's not dead. He said he's still alive. So it's like plot twist into plot twist into plot twist. <laughs> and then the light is back. I remember the crystal story, crystal tower story, at least somewhat. Um, but like realistically, you know, a lot has happened since. The rest of you chat, almost all of you forgot about him. <laughs> but yeah, it must have been really interesting for people who, uh, who hadn't seen him for years. That's why Crystal Tower is not obligatory. Yeah, so I I figured out because Crystal Tower was here, right? And then I remembered that you guys said that Crystal Tower is now obligatory and it wasn't before. So then I kind of started thinking about the Crystal Tower. I don't remember that much about... Like, I remember, um, I remember the boy and the girl and I remember the red eyes. And I vaguely remember the story, but not in detail. Graha sealed himself in the tower in the end. Yeah, to keep it safe. Did I notice he got older? No, I didn't realize that. I only remember the red eyes. So I suspected that he was gonna be the character with the red eyes. I just didn't remember like what he was called and stuff. So that was kind of why like... I was thinking like maybe I should watch some Crystal Tower stuff like to... to like remind myself a bit. Um, but... At the same time I wanted the surprise to happen when it happens, you know? 
God damn it, Emmett. I started liking liking him, but no. No, 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 no.